In this section, we will see the sortable interaction. The sortable interaction is actually an extended drag and drop implementation with a specific functionality. That is, even if you are making some items drag and drop, you will be able to drag the items and drop it wherever you want. But here, you will be able to drag and drop the items so that we can reorder the items or sort the items. So, this is the same web page I have created to explain the selectable interaction. It is just an ordered list of items and I have styled it like this. So that is why this ordered list is appearing like this. Now it is very easy to make this list of items sortable. Here within the document.ready event you just have to select the item. So here the ordered list's id is fruits and you need to add the method dot sortable. This will make the list of items sortable and let's see the output. Refresh. Suppose I want to sort these names in alphabetical order, then I just have to drag the items to the required positions. So drag this and drop it here and next should be banana, right? So I need to drag it and drop it after apple then cherry drag it after banana then let's see like m s p should come before s right m n o p so you could see a blank space when you drag an item suppose i drag orange to drop between m and p that is mango and papaya so you could see a blank space here and if i move it that blank space is occupied here as I move it here. So the remaining items will be adjusted automatically to place it wherever we want. Next we have grapes. So it should be between C and M. So here. So A, B, C, G, M, O, P and S. So these items are now sorted. The sortable can not only be used to sort in the alphabetical order in, or in the numerical order. You can even use the sortable to ask for their order of preference. For example, you can ask the user to sort these fruits in their order of preference. For example, if a person likes mango, he can put it here, then strawberry, it can be put here. So you can use this sortable for different purposes and it is very easy to make items sortable. You just have to add the sortable method. In the following lectures, we are going to see different options that you can use with sortable which will make it more useful. So this is the basic functionality of a sortable interaction. You can make items sortable in the order you prefer.